Hello. This week in Piano Diaries, I'm going to be looking at the idea of pushing forward even when everything else around you seems to be at a standstill. With lockdown, it's very easy to focus on the things that you can't do. And so it becomes very easy to end up lulled into a routine where you just trample around the same ground day after day. In music, this is a very real danger that you often come across in performances. Some of the most beautiful and hypnotic music has a sense of what we say eternity about it, that it can keep going for a long, long time and we lose all our tracking of time. Now we lose this sense of time, hopefully, in a good way. So rather than falling asleep, we stop being able to think about how long we've been going through this particular experience because we're enthralled by it. Schubert is one of those composers who really capitalizes this in a way that no other composer, in my opinion, could. He can create strings of notes, which are repetitions of themselves, echoing all the way through a piece. So seemingly everything is just standing on the same ground. It's not moving anywhere. It's like it cannot move outside of a particular circle, distance from everything else around it. Yet the nuances that he finds in that stillness means that we are constantly enthralled by what is happening. We move forward with it, and so we lose sense of time that actually we've been looking at this beauty for far longer than we can imagine. So, with the idea of moving forward, pushing forward, I've been playing a slow movement of Schubert's little A major sonata this week to see how many nuances I can find within thousands of repetitions. So, Schubert, pushing forward when everything else seems to be at a standstill.